You're not being nice. Are you? You're trying to make me not enjoy it. I see what you're doing. You're trying to make me not enjoy it. I get it. Uh, this is not where we go, actually. We go to the Marbay Dry Docks, don't we? Uh, this is not where we go. I don't. No spoilers! No spoilers! No spoilery goes. Baldy boy! Now, my slaves, I mean prisoners, uh, should have been working extra hard. Right? Some of you got to rank 9 and 10? Nerds. Ah, the order returns. We're pleased to know the team has finished production of the items you requested. We take a little bit of shipping them as well. Here are the earnings. Two hundred and thirty seafarers' calories. Okay. So they're currently at work here. Uh, I'll make some better things later on. Just get them doing. I don't want them slacking. What is this? Concoctions, foodstuffs, accessories. Yeah, this stuff makes more money. Okay, but we need some more stuff. For that. Cool. Okay. Well, now we've upgraded. What happens? Do we have more tools? We do! Alright, we can make a shovel. A true adventurer shovels responsibly. Use this tool to collect additional materials from designated resources. Okay. And uh, better mammoth sized builder's tools. So that needs some tin sand and some island clay. Alright. Seems good. Uh, can we upgrade the cabin again? No. Oh, yeah. And this, uh, I imagine he upgrades when we get more tools. Right, are our pets dead? Hopefully not. They're happy. Wonderful. Have you played the Poe League? No, not yet. Oh, I've got a Sanctuary Fang. Sanctuary Claw. Sanctuary Fur. Oh, you got a lot of XP from the animals. Eggs. I wonder if this means you want to max, like, a type of animal. Milk? Oh, I milked Bex! <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> what a joyous occasion. <laughs> Right, can we do anything here? Oh! <laughs> you fucking crazy bastard. Uh, okay, they're water... They, okay, they're partly grown. It's probably gonna rain, but whatever. We'll, we'll, give, them, we'll give them a water. Have you done the 24 hour sweaty inventory contest? Not yet, not yet. We'll do it in like half an hour. I think I think rank 9 is to beat at the moment. There's someone earlier who has rank 9. Oh, I might need to feed the pets, you're right. Although it says their food is fine. Yesterday, didn't it? When we clicked water, didn't it just do them all? Sure it did. Didn't water the plants, Braggart. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't know if I have enough food for them. I might need to make some food. Alright, we'll make some apple stuff for them. Uh, 
All right, feed Nups. There you go, Nups. I have pleasantly stuffed Emma. It's a good feel. It's a good feel. Doing my duty. Hey, a happy wife is a pleasantly stuffed wife. Uh, we need that stuff to upgrade the tools. Sand, tin, and clay? Where does that come from? Checkers. I assume it comes from just the... Uh... I bet tin's those brown things. Right, do we get more than island sand from here, then? Island Tin Sands. Nice. Yeah, I just, made, I just made a shovel. I've got some new tools I can make. I need some clay and some... Um, uh, Island Tin Sand. Alright, this is giving me clay. I think you should build multiple workshops. Yeah, because I think at some point you get... Someone who was... Uh, Leveling up says you got cop blocked by the uh, by the blue ingredient. Yeah, it looks like Tin Sun's in river stuff. The mini map is so useless. <laughs> it's so massively useless. We're pretty sure though the rare coblin exists on the mountain. I think we're cock blocked on rare coblin. Your hard suck trying to get blue tokens? Yeah, so multiple workshops would probably be smart for that. And crafting, uh, obviously, higher value items. Uh, how do you move the recall thing up there? Oh, uh, go to HUD layout and select duty, and now you can move it. And that'll get you all sorted out, Pad. Buddy. Right, let's get some more clay going. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the cobbling's up on the mountain. Yeah, we've got everything else that I can possibly get right now. Can't remember how much clay we need, but we'll pick up what we can. Uh, it was suffering in the middle of the screen. I know, it's in a really obnoxious place. Was the, honestly, as soon as I got to the island, it was the first thing I did. I didn't even walk up the hill. I was like, well, how do I move this? This is irritating. All your animals are sad. I don't know. All I do is feed them. And occasionally give them a good milking. You know what I mean? Hey, Paddax, thank you so much for the prime, brother. That's so kind of you, man. I've pet them and fed them and they're all still sad. I don't know. Mine all seem happy. I haven't done anything weird with them. Uh, so far, so good with the island. Getting the animals has been the best thing we've done. Island Popoto set. Hmm. Or tin sand. I could definitely see myself just grinding this out. Is this what you guys did to get the super high ranks? You just grinded out XP from looting? I assume you did, right? Yes, okay. Uh, we should need to go up the mountain to see if we can... Oh, no, we don't actually. Let's have some island stone and copper ore. Fine. Hey, good morning, Yuzumi. Well, the island is... If you don't enjoy it, the uh, island is absolutely not mandatory in any way. Uh, anybody got a better location for tin sand?
Like the top, the up this stream seems fine for clay, but uh, not for tin sand. I've only found it in that one place so far. If there's a weird, yeah, the, the gathering logs is usually not accurate for the supreme place. Because you can gather this in various areas. I know it's in the rivers. I get that. But has anybody found like a, you know, like we did with the vines yesterday, where there was that like hot spot where there was tons of them? That's what I'm asking. I know it's the nose in the water. I know that. I'm asking if there's a hot spot where there's like loads of them. Northwood Stream. Gotcha. I think that's probably enough tin sand. How much did we get there? Uh, where's tin sand? Clams, stone. All right, we got 23 clay. All right, we need like a couple more, I think. Uh, Northwood River, this one. while we're here. Uh, absolutely not necessarily. The idle log does not show you like very specific hotspots. It shows you a good area where there's enough of it, but we found yesterday there was some uh, very specific locations where there's just a shitload of them. That's true. The gathering log is usually not the best, best spot. I found a gathering map on Reddit if you want to cheat. I'm just asking, did anybody see one? That's all. I assume Reddit has got into the spreadsheets already, though. This is good. Should be enough, I think. Checkers. We've got 17. I think we only need 10. We should be good. The hideaway may now be expanded with the tools you created. Okay. Uh, are those tools you have there? Beautiful, dangerous tools for cutting things and smashing them up. Give them here. Oh, all right, please give me a thousand seafarers calories. They're not for me, mind you. I need the funds to hire a team. Sure. I have to pay these fucking slave people. It's embarrassing. I should have the option to beat them. Extra plots. Use the word chastise. <laughs> I might want to move my windmill over here, actually. Oh, a granary. What does that do? Okay, so that's those two. Is uh, the other one a decoration one? Check. I don't know if it... Oh, yeah, this isn't a landmark. So I might put my windmill up here then. Oh, I can build a tree house. Or oh, a bath house. I kind of want the bath house. Kinda want the bathhouse. That needs uh, a clam. All right, we need to do some gathering then. Heavy breathing. 
I guess I've got to get my workshops up and running. Uh, when does my windmill finish? In like an hour? Oh, is oh, it done? Toxic windmill. I think I've got to move this to the other landmark location and then put the bathhouse here. Bathhouse by the sea with a view. I don't think this does anything for me though, right? It's just a landmark. Uh, move. You can climb up the treehouse. Treehouse gang. <laughs> oh, that looks better. The windmill on the on the horizon there. That looks way better. Yeah, it looks like where the old man lives who kills people. I'm down for that. Alright, time to get a bathhouse going. Gotta get my clams going. It does, right? It looks like it looks where somebody terrifying lives. It helps in this help section that landmarks do something but don't specify. So you think the windmill makes workshops more efficient? I'm not harboring fugitives. I'm just saying I, I want to give a story to the people who live in my world. That's all. I want them to have a tale to tell. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I work along here. I'm not after any animals right now. Unless... No. Okay, I can't make better catching stuff yet. I'm not, I'm not engaged with dodos. Has somebody caught a black chocobo already? What am I saying? Somebody has. A place for injured animals, not prisoners. They're definitely prisoners. 100%. You have? Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, I need better tools. Need XP. Need more stuff. Alright. I'll be chocobo less for now. You probably need rank 6. That's some serious farming you guys put in. Like some actual dead serious farming. That was some diligent work. Highly diligent. You're rank 8 as well. Good for you. Good for you. Why are all the labs lost? <laughs> they're all together because they're supposed to be at home together. That's why. That's why. Nobody's managed to get up the mountain yet, though. That's beyond rank 10 to get up the mountain. Right, the copper's down here, isn't it? Yeah, copper. Well, we've not looked at Tataru's adventure yet. We've not looked at the MSQ. We'll be doing that uh, next week. There's a lot of ranks. A lot of them. Yeah, I'm excited for the MSQ. It's been so long. Genuinely excited for it. Everyone seems to have enjoyed it. Who's done it already? And the new raid story. Gonna be good next week, man. Gonna be good. Alright, that's enough copper to build our... Uh, Oh, we need clams. I need to dive for clams, right? Off the shore. I do. I need to go diving. 
I have some, but not enough. I think I can ignore Isle Water for now. Or maybe not, because I need to craft a lot of potions. In fact, we might just build something better. Probably be smarter. More copper around. I can't get the sugar from the sugar canes yet. Can we get the cotton now? Fair enough. No cotton for me. Alright, let's go clam hunting. Cottonless and poor. Stupid red penguin. It shows up and I'm just going to get it out in principle. Let's go clam hunting. Uh, I don't know what's happening with Savage next week. I was gonna, uh, I had, like, a ton of things were happening, but they all seem to have stopped now. I actually don't know. At the moment, we're kind of playing it by ear to see what happens. They probably are near Pirate Bay, but let's pick up this anyway. It's not like it'll go to waste. All the raiders are focused on their islands. <laughs> Fuck that penguin, man. That penguin was the worst. Hey, I'm a clam diver. I have no shames about it. Just looking for pearls, baby. Just looking for pearls, that's all. Speaking of raiders, Sphi hit rank 8 yesterday. Nice. I was amazed to see that, like, some of the, some, how many dudes have never even, like, touched the saucer. Why is my wife sending me videos? Is this porn? Nope. Just my dog lay on the floor getting his belly rubbed. Things that'll bring a smile to anyone's face. It makes me happy. Uh, good, good. Gonna do a little bit here, and then we're heading off to the culmination of Shadowbringer's roll quest. And I believe something is. Uh, once you've done them all, you get a little extra tidbit. Uh, you can't fish, no. They wired it so you didn't have to have any gathering. You need any gathering professions for this. Island addict. Uh, Pirate Bay. I'm not an addict. I'm a way less than most people. Screw you guys. I've already got the penguin, mate. Penguin is old news. I got a penguin yesterday. I snatched that guy. I don't need multiple red penguins either. That's just showing off. That's imprisonment. Black sheep. Ahoy, black sheep. Black sheep's up if you've not got it. It's up now. Right there. You don't have your black sheep. Just saying. It's, unless they've changed it. Does it still spawn for everybody? Can we still work as a cohesive unit to get this stuff? Yes? Okay. That, uh, where? If you want the black sheep, it's around there. It's right in the middle of the pack. It's up right now. I'm not sure when it's going to despawn, but we should have a few minutes to grab it. BFA Islands? I know. I keep calling them Island Expeditions. I can't help it. I keep calling them Island Expeditions. 
I feel bad for it, but it's the way it is. I've got three sheep. The white one is Zoe. The black one's a Gimpy and a Landra. <laughs> Zoe is the... Uh, Zoe's the generic brand, is she? Kind of, kind of mean. It's not PCSD. It's just that I spent two years saying Island, Ex island Expeditions. It rolls off the tongue. I don't think that's my fault. I did go back to Dragonflight Alpha the other day and I, uh, I did the big assault that we needed around to unlock. <clears throat> Not a fan. Not a fan. Many, many bar filling sections of the big events. There's a cave. It was uh, a four stage event. The first one was to fill the bar. The second one was to fill a bar. The third one was a boss. And then th the four final one was another boss. But you could pull the boss to this mass amount of NPCs that just killed the boss for you. But it like recommended five people to do it, but they had NPCs helping you finish it. So me and Chris duoed it like very easily. I really wish they'd instance that stuff off and give it some... Uh, some pop. That'd be nice. But I can give you a teaser of the video Chris is working on right now. And possibly one of the goofiest things we've done in a while. Uh, I, I got it, Mike. So you wonder when I sometimes have to finish the stream at like 2 o'clock or whatever, what we get up to. <laughs> now I promise you this will all make sense. Alright? This will all make perfect sense very soon. Yeah? So, trust. <laughs> trust. This will all make perfect sense. <laughs> Uh, easily one of the goofiest things we've done in a while. I mean, this is what happens when Chris takes a break. Take a look at this. Where is it? What am I looking at? What is going on with that leg? Beautiful. Beautiful. A return to form. That's what I'd say. It breaks new ground. Oh, it takes less than five pints to get me there. Way less. If I could do karaoke after two Budweiser's, we're all set. I hope they fix the music in this zone, though. Sure. Does Sprint even work underwater? I can't even tell. feel like it does or maybe i just feel better than i did it oh this view is wrong nope nope we don't need that all right we got these last couple of clams and then we should be good to get our bathhouse going lava that's a clam Clam me, daddy. Perfect. More important than workshop is bathhouse. Treehouse gang losers.
boiling bathhouse. You may review the estimated time completion for any landmark that is under construction, of course. Alright, so that's not going to be ready till tomorrow. Oh no, it'll be ready tonight. Sweet. Alright, so two more workshops, I guess. This is what we need. Wait, we need three more workshops? Or are they capped at two? Oh no, because we need a granary, don't we? Shit. Uh... Right, we need a granary. I need a notepad. Okay, so granary is 10. We need a notepad. 10, 10. 10 clay. 10 copper. 5 vines. Okay. And we need two workshops. So that's going to be 30 total. Palm leaves. 20. We've already got, which is great. Uh, limestone. We've already got. Don't need to worry about it. Uh, vines. We need another 10 vines. We need 15 total. So we've already got all the vines we need. And sand. We've got plenty of as well. So cool. I can just build this now. Nope, we'll do the roll quest after we get the island going. I'll put my granary... I've got a spare plot downstairs, haven't I? Yeah, okay. Okay, that's two workshops built. So all I need then to get my granary going is some clay. That's it. Awesome. And then we got everything built. Super. Uh, you can review materials needed in Manch Hideaway. Yeah, I know. Thanks, sir. Because we're going to need a lot of blue boys. Island glam is something crafters make. Weirdly, you do need crafters to build you the prisms to uh, modify the island. Oh, this is tin sand coming back. I don't know what the max rank is. I wonder when someone will complete <laughs> I haven't bought any of the glam that they sell here yet. There's the clay we need. I'll get an island, gl island glam when we get there. At the appropriate time. The glam's a trap. If, yeah, if you're serious about your island, the glam is a trap. Here to many more of slash. Hey, Karis, how you doing, brother? I, well, I got trapped because I bought the, uh, what was it? I bought a farmer's straw bed. I spent hundreds on this. I thought I could put it down in my, um, my cabin. Nope. Because I thought I could put it in the cabin and uh, have a nice bed. I got played like a damn fiddle. How do you get a fleece off a penguin? It looks like they give you one item daily. 
And where did you put it? I haven't put it anywhere. I'll go put it in my room after this. So at least I get some use out of it and I can claim it was intentional. I think that's enough clay. The only thing I guess we're going to miss is enough stuff to keep the um, keep everything running. I guess that's what we're going to miss. Okay, granary's underway. Two workshops are underway. We already have this workshop running, don't we? Oh, I've got plenty. Alright, so... Um... Completion site at 2pm, 2pm... And the granny's at 2 p.m. All right, so we do need to come back at 2 p.m. to get the rest of the workshops going. Perfect. Okay, for now, I think we're good. Siri, remind me at 2 p.m. to go and get my workshops. I got this. We're organized. <laughs> We're all set. Okay. Uh, fuck, it's been a while since I've done this. Uh... Shit, come back. Why is it not locking in place? Do I double click it? There we go. It's not good. <laughs> uh, that is a that is a big waste of coin of of blue boys. It is. That is that's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. not ideal. Does it look comfortable?
Kind of? It needs to be outside. It just looks like I'm going to have to constantly clean this up. Right? It's a sweeping nightmare. And at some point, it's just going to all be lost. Yeah, I can't say I've ever slept on hay. I don't particularly want to do that either. Oh, did I change the thing? Did I? Uh... Oh, I did. I locked everybody out. It's because I kept coming in my room and you guys were all, like, doing stuff. People were always in here doing things I didn't want. <sighs> Braggart is expensive. Ever since he started wanting to be paid. You guys are paying? He charges me. Our, our prices are very competitive. We still got no chat bubbles, I guess. Chat bubbles are out. All right. Crystarium, here we come, baby. FF7 is absolutely on the schedule, yes. I just can't seem to get my save game working. I'm going to have to fidget with it. I did try it out uh, recently. I just can't seem to get the save game working on it. It's very annoying. Let's just double check it. Out. I, I changed the file last night, so let's see. I'm not going to play it right now, but if, uh, if this is working, I'll be happy. My controller's not working, which is annoying. Yeah, see? Bam. So, I don't know. That's the only problem I've got with it right now, is I just can't seem to get that working. And I don't know why. Because the saved game file is in the right place. But it's not working. Yeah, our save file is in there. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm figuring it out. I'll find it. I'll get there. I'll figure it out. Uh, we need to be a healer, don't we? Yes, we do. Yeah, I've put 7th Heaven on. Let's try it again. Let's try again, see if this works. Uh, there's an update? Not right now. Uh, I've not gone through these. We didn't like the new music, did we? Shit. Uh, 
shit. We had some configuration to do here, didn't we? Uh, Mega Chocobo, no. What was that one? Uh, sound overhaul. We didn't like that, did we? Because that made footsteps on the metal plates and people got very upset. Okay, better backgrounds, better battle textures, better spell textures. Yes, yes. Uh, menu and fonts. This was the better FMVs. Yes. Borderless. Yes. 60 FPS. No, we didn't like that, did we? It ran really weird. Uh, soundtrack, no. Voice acting, no. Mm, I don't think we have that one. Hmm. I didn't have this the other day. Probably installed a system folder which can cause mods not to work. It is recommended you install it in C Games FF7. The voice acting mod wasn't bad, but people just preferred me to do it. Um, that, that was the only difference. Sure. No, it wasn't bad at all. It was a really fair effort those guys did. <laughs> Failed to find the game disc. Oh, no. Beep, boop, 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 boop. Oh. Oh. We don't appear to... My dude lives. <laughs> my dude lives, and we will probably see my dude tomorrow. Okay? Okay? My dude lives. We have 500 gil left. <laughs> we have 500 gil left. We literally spent every single last penny we have. In the gold saucer, and we won nothing. We won nothing. We won absolutely nothing. All right, well, before we get into that, <laughs> my dude lives. He does. My dude lives. Let's cry. Uh, am I in the wrong place? No, I'm not. Okay. It's not another four months. No. Oh God, there's a there's a little party going on. <laughs> You're honestly the worst dwarf. Oh, I've got to do dwarf voice? Oh, God. Okay, dwarf voice. Traditions and travails. A hearty-looking dwarf stands before you, draining a flag and a veil, remarkably swiftly given his helmet. Okay, here we go. Don't you know it's better not to sneak up on a dwarf mid-flagon? Uh-huh. Not even a proper greeting, neither. Look here. Wally -o! The name's Git. 
Lolly ho, my friend. Lolly ho. See now that's a greeting. Lolly ho's aside. Just who are you anyway? I dare say I'd remember someone like yourself if we'd ever met. You're from the same strange land as the Crystal Eggs, aren't you, say? Well, well, well. He's an odd sort, the Exarch is. He knows things, right? And he's got some sort of mystical power. Don't suppose you're the same, are you? Because I could use someone with power the likes of which the world has never known. I'm on Incinius, you see. Well, one in particular. A healer? <laughs> and not half bad at the job, eh? I like your confidence. And I wish I could take your word for it, since you sound just like what I'm looking for. But you've got to prove it, lass. There's no need for that, listen here. The sin of your eye hunt ain't your average abomination. You can't blame me if you want to make sure that I'm not leading you to grave. That'd be bad for both of us. So you get yourself on over to Forest at Lost Shepherd, and we'll see what you've got. Oh, and uh, Lalio! We've got a whole day with a dwarf. All right, wonderful. All right, I'm sorry to steal your dwarf, guys. I'm sorry. But I have done. Celine's got this. How dare you, man? How dare you? You would, you would trust Celine over me? Animals. Animals. Anytime. <laughs> oh, Braggart was RP and I couldn't see it because of no chat. FML, dude. Hey, Genius Weasel, thank you for the 28 months, man. What's happening, dude? Glad you found place all right. Now for prey. Mm. Oh, that'll do. Now, just take a deep breath. And... Hey! Your mother was an hobgoblin. He ain't much to look at neither. Come here and face me, you craven shite. Sweet Dwarven victory. <laughs> Though Geot lies prone, the creature appears indisposed to cease its rampage. It seems that it will have to be dealt with. Is that because I didn't heal? Because that's not fair. I didn't have a chance to. Right? I don't think that could be considered my fault, honestly. Oh, for fuck's sake. Sorted. Zirconix, thank you for the 61 months, brother. Thank you, man. <laughs> See? That wasn't so bad. I reckon that I broke three or so ribs or at least one femur there, but my bones feel fine just now. Better than before, actually. And that beast gave you no trouble. Seems to be just what I'm looking for after all. We can talk about the rest back in a Crystarium over a drink of three. The folks at the Wandering Stairs know how to keep them coming. Meet me there. 
I think my guy might be a bit of a loser. I'm going to have to deal with this fucking half ass dwarf prick. I'm going to have to heal him through the worst of times, aren't I? Rude, he died to a low level mob, man. Like, you saw it. Don't pretend you didn't. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. Shame on you. Oh, come on. Oh, there ain't nothing like a flag and a veil after a well earned victory. You didn't do anything. Did you hit your head? Oh, yes, and hard as well. The beast gave me a trouncing. Really exceeded my expectations, as did you. <laughs> Whatever you want to call what we just did, doing it helps us understand each other, sure enough. I've seen you're a masterful fighter, and you learn that I'm fearless as the stone. And so, a fellowship is forged. Oh. Now, now that I'm sure you won't get yourself killed, I can tell you about the Sin Eater I'm after. It's one of them so-called cardinal virtues. Sophracine. And it's a nasty piece of work. Each of the virtues looks like one of those fools who brought the flood upon us, but this one, this one takes the worst of the bunch. Lam it. Disgrace to all dwarven kind. Knowing that one of our own was a warrior of light is bad enough. But Sophocene being out there looking all dwarf like, well, it don't help matters. The cursed thing. Council of Elders. They don't want to live with the shame of Lamet's sins no more. So the head of the council, the most elder, the most elder. Stay with me, eh? Gave me this job. Hunt down Sophocene. Slay it. See, they don't keep sullying our good name. I'm our strongest warrior. Fuck. You guys are doomed. So if anyone's gonna do it, it has to be me. That's fine. I'm more than up for a contest of might. The problem I'm having, though, is Sophracene keeps fucking healing itself, man. It's worse than the Druid in the Burning Crusade. It's bollocks running round fucking pillars left and right. Healing itself for better damage in it's healing itself. Deeply annoying. I suppose it's because Lamy herself was some kind of master at heart, but... Sophracene's healing's so powerful that I no matter how hard I whack it, it can't leave a scratch. To make matters worse, it fucking flies! Flies! Carefree as you please! Resurrecting other Sin Eaters! We'll be up to our nuts in them if, if we don't do something about those curative powers! That's where you come in, alright? Sure. Great! With those skills of yours at hand, we'll find a way to put an end to this stain on my people's history. Once and for all. You might not have heard, but the tales say that Lamet won't land without a fucking beard on! Without a beard! She willingly showed her face to those who weren't kin! She knew full well that it would dishonor her and us all. And she did it anyway. Then there's the part about bringing doom to all world. Not one of our taboos really, but it's generally frowned upon that. And now she's back. Face. Better world. A sin eater. What could make a dwarf go so wrong? Ah, but we have ale to drink in sin eaters to hunt. In that order. You healed my body, sure enough, but I'll need a few more flagons to restore me vigour. And by a few, I mean about a hundred. <laughs> Come and find me later when I'm pissed up. 
A hundred. That dwarf's going to drink a hundred flagons. I kind of respect it. I know I shouldn't. But I kind of respect it. Affronts and allies. Oh, who are you? You're looking at me, you fucking tall, sour-faced cow. You got something to say, you bastard. Not you, eh? Uh... <laughs> of course, I remember my new partner. And I ain't drunk neither. I'm a dwarf. It'll take more than well. However much I had to get me on the table. And now you know one more thing about me. This will only strengthen our fellowship, I'm sure. But we'll need more than just a sense of camaraderie if we're out to take down Sophistrine. So I'm thinking we should get start with observation. Get you a look at its healing powers. Let you know what we're dealing with. Now, this is the perfect place to overhear the right sort of information. If you listen. Oh, get me wrong, I do you? I don't let it get in the way of no important drinking, but I do pay attention. Anyway, what I heard is that Sofracine's been spotted in Calusia. Then I remembered, there's a little pub over at Stilltide, the Leaky Keel. And they make a decent brew, they do. Some of the folks there should be able to point us in the right direction. To the pub! All right, we're off to the boozer. I don't think it'll be a crawl. It just went looking at. I'm fine. No need to give me that murderous stare. I know what you're thinking. That gear you think to yourself. Always drinking and lounging about and drinking more. What a sluggard. What a drunkard. What a magnificent beard. Oh, I wish I had a beard like that. Yeah, I know. You don't need to explain yourself to me. We really should work on finding you a sense of humor. <laughs> Maybe deal with that after Sophrosine. Might take a while. Anyway, you'll be happy to hear that while I was waiting, I got my hands on some prime information. Also, some excellent wine, which... No, no, no. no. Information first. Right. So, according to the local fisher folk, quite a few city eaters have turned up right near Bright Cliff. I suggest we go there and kill as many as we can find. We can't say for sure when a Sophrosine will appear next, but if it's in the area, I won't piss off a chance to revive its fallen fiends, right? And while we're at it... You can vent some of that pent up rage you've got. No need to be pretty, so long as the job gets done. Just make sure to find me again before Sophrosine shows up. Yeah! This guy must be rolling in money. A dwarf's wealthy, like as a uh, faction, as a race, are they generally quite wedged? Oh, you think you're good with your rare dodo, do you? You're not. You're not. Mining's good money, apparently. Tender love. Oh. That's nice. Oil money. <laughs> How much oil do you think there is? After the flood. Eh? Very limited geographical space to explore. The walls are built, the light's there. It's not like you could just dig anywhere and find good quality oil. Light oil, yeah, the oil from here looks like custard. A lovely vanilla custard. Well, no Sophrosine. Woohoo! Lollafells. Ambrosia. I haven't had custard in ages. Mmm. Custard is good. It's basically thick sugar, but it's nice. 
That should do it. And now we wait to see if Sophrosine shows herself. Come on, let's go over in them bushes. And I've got the wine right here. You don't like custard? I used to genuinely be excited as a kid when my school would provide pink custard. And then there was a war over who would have the, cust the, the custard skin. Oh, she looks so innocent. There, eh, that's it. It's not her fault. She's resurrecting her friends in her eyes. See, it revived the other one. Oh, here we go. Oi, what's wrong with you? So she did have a beard at one time. What a lovely place to die. The world outside is even worse than I feared. someone there you're alive well why didn't you say so i can't do much for the dead but the living that's a whole other matter one res i can't believe it all of my wounds healed Thank you, kind stranger. You sure are lucky that I passed by. You really might have died, you know. You'll hear no argument from me. I was a fool. The thought that the hobgoblin I was after might have friends lying in wait never so much as crossed my mind. I shouldn't have been out here alone. <laughs> With your magic to keep me fighting, though, their numbers wouldn't pose such a problem. What do you say? You don't look like to have a party of your own yet, and I could certainly use a man like you on my side. Well, I'm no man, you unprudent good. Why, I've never been so insulted in all my life. Let me tell you what's what. I'm Lamet, proud daughter of the Trolley family, and if I catch you mocking me again, I'll put you right back the way I found you, you hear? <laughs> yes, ma'am. I certainly didn't mean to offend. The beard misled me, you see. And then they went on to have many great adventures together. And that's that. Look, Ardbert, treasure! You certainly look the hero. Now let's see you act like one. So Lamet was the first to join the Warriors of Light, eh? Hmm. Good idea recruiting the healer first. Hello, Flo? Hey, you want to slow half empty flag and lumbering lummox, pale-faced, emotionless cow? Your mother was a hob and your face looked like a newborn's ass. That was colourful. Straight faced as always. <laughs> A refreshing round of insults always cheers me up, but I'm starting to wonder if you've had as much trouble with fun as you do with jokes. Are you actually sure your mother ain't an ob? Cheeky prick. Yeah, I got the magic crystal powers. Fine, fine, never mind. At least we got what we came for, and you didn't miss much. After Sophrosy brought the other eater back to life, they both floated off to who knows where. But what happened to you? 
I was touched by a magic power that makes me go buzz buzz. You saw Sophrisy, no. The real lamb, it's past. <laughs> I knew you'd have some kind of weird power. Sounds to me like what you witnessed was the beginning of Lamit's journey, right after she left home. It's odd. You said she was wearing her helm, and she helped out the injured traveller just like any dwarf of honour would do. Maybe, uh... Maybe she wasn't born a monster. But then... It don't sit right with me, neither. But well, standing around wondering about it won't do nothing but make us thirsty. We're done here. Let's go back to Crystarium. I think we're going to get, like, the unveiling of how the beard was lost. The day the beard fell away. I wonder if it's going to be like a luchador from Mexico. Like, there was uh, a beard versus beard match or something like that. Loser has to remove the beard. It would make sense, right? Pre-watched. <laughs> when they baked into Lucha Libre. It is a grudge. You never remove a, a wrestler's mask. It's just rude. Hey, will you lay off the beer, Luca? Alright. There's far too many goddamn dwarves around here. Tank riding idiots. Ah! <sighs> Oh, there ain't nothing like a flag and a veil after a job well done. Don't give me that look. I did this I did stuff this time, you saw. I'm not like that fucking Thancred character who kept turning up after it was all done. I was there. And you also saw Sophrisine work its magic. But since you haven't said anything about it yet, I'm guessing you didn't have no sudden revelations about to stop it. Don't worry. I didn't expect you to solve my old problem just like that. I only need you to remember what you saw today. Keep it in your mind. And maybe something will come to you when you're working your magic elsewhere. Me? Oh, I like to think while I drink. It's the most efficient way, so you can find me here if you need me. I'll let you know when we have a plan. A realm reborn, Thancred. Never forget. Never forget. The Thancred minions on Island Sanctuary say this is Thancred. Yeah, they do. I thought it was really good because I've put them to work in my um, my fields. And uh, you go up to, the, to get some, uh, pick some crops and they all give you a big this is Thancred. <sighs> Lolio! <laughs> Looks like you've been training hard. It in fact, you, you, your muscles show much bigger. It's almost like there's three of you. Yeah, I'm joking, as you know, but you do seem stronger. I don't suppose you came with a clever plan for stopping Sophrisy while you were at it. Don't worry, I have another test in mind that'll get us some more information. Then we'll be better to set to think of something. We'll be killing Sin Eaters again, but this time you're healing them. Well, trying to anyway. <laughs> I don't expect it to work. Sin Eaters ain't like us, or like any sort of normal creature. But by seeing your healing magic fail to heal them, we should learn why it don't work. And then, then maybe we can figure out what's so different about Sophrisy. I've heard from folks passing through that stray Sin Eaters find their way to our meringue pretty often. Meet me aboard, Sook, and be ready for carnage. I'm going to try healing the Sinias. Sure, I guess. Mod Sook. At least we're not in Lahi country just yet, dudes. We are Lahi free. You know, I heard that liquor here ain't fit to drink, but it's not half bad, you know. Gets job done with a real kick. Oh, I know what you're thinking. That gear, always down in one ale or another, you think to yourself. 
And so I'm gonna eat too! I'm uncontrollably jealous! I just can't take any more! And you quietly weep on the inside! I'm sympathetic, I am! But my drinking's important! No, oh, indispensable! Dwarves get fiercer the more they drink! Really fuels fire within! I can see you don't believe me! Fine! You leave me no choice! I'll show you! I'll go on ahead and dice some city years in time it takes you to finish off this mod swill here. Just go back down and come and find me. Southeast of here, you'll see. Have I really got a drink? What cock tank? A half-finished bottle of alcohol, apparently purchased by Giot, sits on the map. The local concoction within is deep brown. And from it wafts a stench that can only be described as atrocious. No. A feeling of foreboding, be it an effect of the echo or something more instinctual, overpowers you so much as look at the contents of the bottle. You decide to abstain and make up an excuse to tell Giot later. I'm not drinking it. Very good, very good. <laughs> Only more than joy, Abru. No one else ever drink as much as that dwarf. Don't worry, Shansen. <laughs> Lahi's the best island music. Have you got Lahi playing from your place? That's awesome. <laughs> Music in, Jan in uh, Shadowbringers is so gentle for the most part. Just to remind you of how tragic everything in this world is. The eater appears to have been roundly bludgeoned by a rather overly enthusiastic maul wielder. See? Your average city has no match for me. Not with the power of tradition and alcohol on my side. As a matter of fact, I put down another before I got around to this one here, but uh, I did the job a bit too well. Really mangled that thing, actually. And then it all went dark. Anyway, it was pretty gross. Flattened in all the wrong places with bits poking out and the like, so <laughs> I got it out of here. Anyway, you get the idea. I drink a lot, I kill stuff. You have to admit that it's an effective strategy. And now that we've got our city and patient, you can try out. You really got it. Go on. Oh, I don't get to cast the spells. Okay. This doesn't make me a bad healer. As we thought. None. Did you figure out the why of it? Healing magic and seers just don't mix. I think it was never really alive to begin with. Hmm. Go with that one. No, Celine can't do this. You're right on that one. Seers may look like people and beasts, but it's like they're just pretending. They're not truly alive. Only the light drives them. Keeps them going like winding an automaton. An healing magic ain't meant for restoring life to something that didn't have none to begin with. But if Sophocene's power ain't like the healing magic we know, what is it? I also wonder why it don't come and revive this one. Is it just too far away to take notice, I wonder? Then again, I never heard tell of it appearing in Allminster Switch either. So many Sidious get killed there, you think it would take note eventually. Oh, no. So why only resurrect some Sidious and not others? This is all too much thinking, not enough drinking. To the Crystarium we go. Oh, is that a radius? Or is she healing people that she previously knew? Or, she's healing people in locations where the Warriors of Light needed healing. That's why she healed where Ardbert was. There we go. Mm hmm. She's only doing it, that's my guess. They put the skip cutscene button right next to the skip for, uh, next dialogue button. Kinda rude. <laughs> See, I told you, Luca. I told you to lay off. 
The mod stuff's alright, but this is fine, Hale. At least that's what my body tells me, and I always listen. That's how I keep my muscles primed and my spirits high. Speaking of, would it kill you to relax a little? Being so serious all the time can't be good for you. And the silent staring just makes you seem morose. We won't kill Sophrosine any faster for not drinking, that's for sure. Nothing comes easy to sober folks. And that's why I need a few more in me before I can really get to work figuring out why Sophrosine does what it does. I keep feeling like I'm missing something obvious. But what? Hmm. Hey, Dark Wolf, thank you. You got your island to level six? Yeah, we'll be, uh, after this cutscene, we'll check who's the most degenerate island goer. We've got a display to give away. I think Emma might be here. <laughs> <laughs> I'd ask if you're here for a drink, but I know you're not. You've got that serious look about you. As usual. I've got my usual here too, my fifth round of it, in fact. <laughs> Why so few, you ask? Well, I stepped away for a while to do some research, but that moron bloke kicked me right out of cabinet of curiosity and banned me for life. What up, player? Getting ready for your birthday tomorrow, pal? Oh, you're rocking some Bloons TD6? Are we gaming or what? Oh, you put a shimmer on. What does shimmer do? Why have you put a shimmer on? What does it do? Oh, you're checking the notes. You don't. It, it uncovers invisible balloons. Yeah, you camo balloons, mate. Which one's good? Uh, I like uh, full auto rifle for good balloon clear. Oh, you are you playing co-op balloons? We got double balloons in. We're double balloons in. Double balloons in. You played solo. I've got this. Fine. You're getting a necromancer. Yeah, so. High five. Then you get that. He turns into a chair. Yeah. yeah I'm <laughs> he sits on a throne. He doesn't turn into a chair. <laughs> he sits on a throne. <laughs> What's happening, gangster? Right, so you just walk in and you demand my PayPal. Oh no, I can do it. What a lovely wife of yours. You want to leave your kid here? I get it. As long as he's left with something to do so he's not trolling. Glad you liking him, so uh, you're just leaving him here, eh? He's fine here for an hour, but when you say an hour, is this like yesterday's hour where you were two hours? <laughs> have you taken yeah, it to the tip though, or have you just left it on the landing? Oh, that's much better. I need to. He's not going to fit in that. He did it! He did! He's not turned into a chair yet, though. You haven't got enough, have you? You're poor. You're poor. Well, let's go get that. Alright. Alright, stops crowding me now, right? We're in the middle of a lolly ho investigation. Ooh, what is... Why, dude? What? Is this you voice acting, James? you got to make it sound like a dwarf. Come on, James. Oh, you're shy now. No, he's okay, alright. Okay, that Max go first. You have to sound like a dwarf. Why so few? Why so few? Why so few? You ask. Well, I stepped away. Why is it like a devil dwarf? <laughs> I got it. I got it. <laughs> Why is it like an evil Daddy, dwarf? Daddy, I got one. What does this do? You're better than me, Daddy. Oh, thank you. Why, so few, you ask? Well, I stepped away for a while to do some research, but then Moran Bloke kicked me right out of the cabinet of curiosity, and then they banned me for life. Bill, just a wee bit of meat on the box, and he chases you out with the fury of a thousand floods. If Max 
could use a drink, if you ask me. And you've got one. Master Clarys, don't tell me. You're, you're sliding with him over with me. Supposed to be a partner. Partner. Well, there you go. We've got everybody in. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Amateur hour. Give me space. Mine's a little different. <clears throat> and after I worked so hard to find us new information on Sophocene, drank so much, sat with those dusty tomes until not one but both of me buttocks went numb. Awesome. There you go. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not what we came for. Go on, out. We came to do work. Go in there or you won't see seven. Go in there or you won't see nine. Oh, I thought you talking about ages. I thought you knew some yeah. kid called seven then. <laughs> <laughs> so, did you find anything? You know, after I went through the cabinet, your complete refusal to acknowledge anything I do is comforting, actually. Anyhow, I did get some new information from a reliable source, a drinking buddy of mine. Sophocene was seen recently in Lahi Land. If we do some of our signature eater slaying in forests, there's a chance we'll draw it out. I figure that see around thinking isn't getting us anywhere. And research can only take us so far, so why not? Maybe fighting it together will teach us something we couldn't learn otherwise. We can't kill it, mind. But the two of us should be more than capable of getting a few whacks in and making an escape. I fought it before, you know, and come away fine. Mostly. <laughs> so that's the plan. Meet me at Slitherbow. Then we'll go a-pummeling. What do you mean? Because it's an alcoholic dwarf. Johnny Vegas. How tall is Johnny Vegas? About five foot summer, right? He drank a hundred gallons of mead. No, our guy. Oh, I've got a competition for you, actually, Em. you got ten minutes. Have you? Alright, just chill for a sec. Don't worry. There you are! I didn't mention it earlier, but I've been here looking for Sophocene before. I know most everyone in Slitherbow, actually. Emma's gonna try Slice. Sure, they seem an odd lot at first. What with that worshipping darkness and all. But once you get to know them, share a few drinks. They're not bad folks. They can find wine, too. Shame you can't get it anywhere else. Anyhow, they've been helping me out before I joined local spirits. Seems that Sophocene showed itself in the blind forest of Yggmarja east of here. Let's go out there and slay a few cities like we did before. And see if that brings it to us. Okay, Em. We're going to the magical place called the Gold Saucer. And every 20 minutes, there's a major event that takes place. The best of all of these is called the Slice is Right. You remember Ross from PreachCon? There's Ross. He's getting ready for Slice, as you can see. Yeah? Primed and ready to go. So we're going to head down here. It's not. What's going to happen is you're going to be placed onto this platform. Okay? And then there'll be towers that come up that get sliced by the most amazing samurai, Yojimbo. And they'll fall in a direction. And you have to just not get hit. It's very easy. It's very easy. Because Slice is what binds our community together. Okay? Now, you're looking at a lot of people who came to PreachCon here, actually. <laughs> right? Yatak. Yeah. Hi, Era from Liverpool. Yeah? You really try the headphones for that. Can we get a wah? <laughs> oh, 
Alright, turn the seat. Good, who looks bad? This white one looks good. That one. You've got to have a white. I can't, it won't move. Zoomed it in, it just spins back round, look. You've done that. I did that. I've been doing so you can look. Yeah, but it just spins back round. Yes. I'm, I'm using black and white. Using black What about Ross? No. no. You don't remember Braga? He was on the stage, he was the one sweeping up the village. Yeah. I like that little one. That one. High error approved. I like this one. I think that's nuts. I like that one. <laughs> I don't like it. You don't like it? No. Why? Um, not into that. I like this one. <laughs> that one's nice. Okay. Well, you do like the butterfly wings, what do you think of that one? Yeah, I like that one. I like this little You one. can click on them with your left mouse, so you know. This one here. Yeah. I like this one. You like the Lala's. Do you not think they look horrifying? I like this one. I do not like this. Move over. <laughs> you have to talk to the man. <laughs> I don't like this one. No, why? Nah, don't like that one. Don't like the chicken head thing. Hold right mouse to aim at things. Uh, I don't like that one. You don't like the summer dress? No. Uh, I like... Ooh. Right mouse button. <laughs> this one I like. 
Oh god, I hope that's not Raven. I really like that one.